Galahad, come in. Galahad, acknowledge this is coming. Even earlier. Read you, Percival. Enjoying a stroll in the park, are we? Nothing quite like a chilly London morning to stimulate the senses. Not to interrupt your little constitutional, but we have confirmation of multiple marks of Grosvenor Square. What are our directives? Rendezvous at the United India House with Igraine and Lafayette and contain the threat. Do you have it in sight? United Indian House. Right in front of me. Good. Assess the situation once there and proceed. I'm with glad you spotted it. Did Nicola provide you with armament? I'm guessing he's talking about yes. Tesla. Essex M2 Falchion. Good. The Falchion's secondary ordnance should help. What secondary ordnance? We may be pursuing Bedlamites, but they remain civilians. Use non-lethal force whenever possible. <coughs> Understood. Are you okay, joining okay. us? I have a small matter to attend to. I'll find you afterwards. En route now. Got that out. Okie dokie. Let's have a little walk. Been good. Would have been awkward <laughs> if I'd walked all the way here to find a locked door. Okay, sure. Wait a second. There's no reflection in her. <gasps> I must be. What is it? Vampire? I can't remember. You never know, there's werewolves. Okay, I, can, I think I can do that. Which way is the right way? I hope that I haven't just like discovered like a major spoiler, like, spoiler that it's like vampire, <laughs> there's vampires in this <laughs> or something. Just saying, werewolves always seem to be fighting vampires, so wouldn't be surprised me that much. Morning, I guess. What's this? Serious disappearance in Whitechapel. I'm not reading all of that. If you want to pause and read all of it, go ahead. But I'm going to move on. <laughs> It's very interesting. Look at this photograph. Twenty of July, eighteen eighty six. Word Ham Family. Sure, okay. I don't know if that's important or anything. Good day, sir. Good day. Oh, horsey. Is this my house or it's where I live or is I'm, am I just passing by? Lift not working. Great. Guess I'm taking the stairs. By the way, I, I, I am walking as fast as I can, so if I take a wrong turn, it's going to take me this long, yes. Ooh, shiny. Okay. Photograph sender. Send to record audio messages. Go to options. 
Uh, it befell in the days of Uther Pendragon, when he was king of all England, and so reigned that there was a mighty duke in Cornwall that held war against him long time. And the duke was called the Duke of Tintagel. And so by means, King Uther sent for this duke, charging him to bring his wife with him, for she was called a fair lady and a passing wise, and her name was called Igraine. So when the duke and his wife were come unto the king, by the means of great lords they were accorded both. The king liked and loved this lady well, and he made them great cheer out of measure, and desired to have lain by her. But she was a passing good woman, and would not assent unto the king. And then she told the duke her husband, and said, I suppose that we were sent for that I should be dishonored. Wherefore, husband, I counsel you, that we depart from hence suddenly, that we may ride all night unto our own castle. Okay. I'm guessing that's some it's like history of the order or something like that. I'm on my way down to the street. Acknowledge. Okay, okay. Having up the place. I probably won't have make you listen to all those. I think it'd be better if I just. <coughs> oh, that was a hell of a jump. Did that so calmly. It wasn't just like. And I'll jump here. Have any reflection in the windows? <laughs> there must be a vampire or ghost. One of the two. And down we go. Galahad, the grey. Any word from the fire? Negative. Same here. We're probably off somewhere gallivanting. Well, I know your concerns, but trust me, he's a good lad. Is this the French guy? So? In any case, I have no time to look for him. I'm assigning the last few constables to their posts. Charles Dickens. Tell two cities. I can't remember if that's a good play. It's a blank piece of paper with stains on it. There you go, there's something to um, recognise the date. I don't know, 1866? Or I don't know what really happened in 1866. Nay. I'm guessing this French guy is not. doesn't behave himself, let's say. Ma'am, I'll suggest you and your husband stay inside. MCM. Mayfair, ooh, Mayfair. Am I in Mayfair? Oh, very posh. You okay, mate? It's a shiny ring. It, well, it's a flask. Is it something I can do with it? Alright, sir. Need to break snow, sir. We need to stay alive. Tell us the reason behind the commotion. I'm sure it's not. He doesn't sound well. Galahad, see that you cordon off the entire district and do it quietly. How did you arrive here so quickly? I got here quickly. Skill, wow. love. I must admit, you do move fast for a man of your age. 
And I curse Oi. to be reminded of his decrepitude by a fair damsel. My lord, this damsel would never be so callous as to do such a thing. Sure is he. Would you ever? Ah. <laughs> <sighs> Who are the marks? Bedlamites running amok. What? Percival thinks it could be a rebel subterfuge. Let's hope you haven't lost your edge. Remember who trained you? Goddamn he was the best rebels. In his day. Was. You're still pretty good. But I'm better. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Hey, Grain, come in. Acknowledge, Percival. Multiple escapees spotted at the east entrance of the United India Underground Station. Intercept with caution. Understood. Come on, Gray. Let's move. Are we taking the underground then? Oh, I shouldn't go spreading all things of conspiracy. Take this intrusion, for example. Why would mere mental detainment require the presence of Hey, I can run. Finally. Come on, get on with it, but I want to explore. I want to admire the beauty. Good morning, fine sir. Don't mind me. It's your police business. Yes, police. I wouldn't, I wouldn't very weirdly. Once we're inside, don't let anyone else through. Sure you don't need help, love. Do you Shut mean up. a strong man to take control of things? That's right. Just stay out of our way. I'd hate for you to get shot by mistake. <laughs> the usual trigger happy mercenaries. The United India Company prefers its minions enthusiastic. The last thing we need is a band of hired guns causing more havoc. I've told them to remain on lockdown. Of course, this is 1866, so expect sexism, of course. Whoa, 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 good. Uh, I'm Going on here. Galahad, take cover. Let's get to work. Okay. Boom, headshot. Let's reload. We're clear. Move up. I've got this giant rope on my back and I use a... MK1 service arrival. Auto-loading, auto-loading pistol. Devil scum. Get out of here! Find some weapons! You two! Get your asses over here! I need help! Come on, go! Let's call you bloody bastards! A rifle would be more appropriate. Yes, finally. Target down! More SKPs coming from the alley. Some are heading for the atrium. Down. Gotcha. Street clear. There are more in the courtyard. Okay, okay. It's not on the floor. Oh, pistols. It's on the stairs. Watch your aim! 
I didn't shoot you. Ooh, my headshot. my secondary fire do? Ooh, ammo. Oh. I swear I'll blast his head into goddamn mash! Help! There could be more in the atrium. We should move in. I can hear more commotion inside. Oh. Hurry. More bedlamites inside. Shot. You okay, man? Yeah. Sorry about blasting you with air. <clears throat> so that's what the secondary fire's for. Is Whoa! He? Are you alright? Damn it! Is that you drinking? Oh no, oh! Oh god, they're slaughtering them! Ready? Just get rid of this scum! Smoke Let's do it! Right. Book me! Okay. Flanking them. In the bar. There we go. Ooh. Ow. Oh, she, she, she's just running in there. Didn't even hit you. Come on. Enemy down. There were more on the level above. We need to get up there. Got it. Oh no, they put the ship. Damn you fiends. Okay, going up. We should clear the second floor. Obviously. Everything to your liking thus far? Quite. Just another ordinary London morning. Indeed. <laughs> Although I do hope that was only the beginning. Quite. Ladies first. Did she take offence to that or something? She just gave me an odd look. You think we'll get to shoot a few of them rich folk? Huh? Yeah. Say no more. <gasps> right. Oh. Oh. 
right. Shit. I was he wasn't stealthy enough. Ow. Green's going red. Oh, this is an all oh. oh. Come on, pop your pop your head out. Pop your head out. Room clear. Oh, we've made him such a mess. Swing this way then. Enough. I don't know what I was doing there. Who knows? Like, shoot, 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 shoot. what? <laughs> Should have really explained that a little you bit too. more. Sir, downstairs. There are civilians who need your assistance. Yes, sir. Sir, General Raphael is in the next room. Ah, oh, God. Has he gotten into, us into trouble? You're joking. Ugh. Is there a single woman in this city you won't try to seduce? He's awfully calm. It's your problem now. Do try not to lag behind. Consider we just shut up this old place. Lafayette. Ah, monsieur. Uh, this lady requires my attention. I'm sure Marquis. she does. Your attention is required elsewhere. I assure you, mademoiselle, that only the vow of fidelity prevents me from accepting your invitation. Oh, Marquis, you mustn't leave now. Unfortunately, my lady, my duty compels me elsewhere. <sighs> Stereotypical French guy being a lady lady killer. Hmm. How cliche. Most fetching, was she not? I hadn't noticed. That is because you are not a Frenchman. You are the most American Frenchman I have ever known. I am a lover of liberty, mon ami. A proper knight must learn to curb his passions. Without passion, monsieur. A man cannot fight. We do not fight men, Marquis. Men, half-breeds, what does it matter? Vive la liberté! <sighs> I already don't like, I already dislike him already. And that's because he's French. Nice. What? What are you looking at? Strange. Two men are acting suspicious. Oh, now we're heading underground. Let's go. It's about time. <laughs> 